Hey everybody, what's going on? Michael here. Today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to rank up really fast in Call of Duty Black Ops 2. Now, this is not really a kind of a tutorial, but it's kind of like tips and tricks. And it's going to be kind of like a little kind of guide to teach you on like where you should start and where you should go. So what exactly we're going to be doing is we're going to be going and getting small kill streaks that you know you're going to be able to aim for and get. As well as you're going to be able to make sure you go to a kill confirmed or a hard point. Now these are the two I recommend, but you can just find anything you do get the most points in. Now just pick up some really low kill streaks that you're going to know you're going to be able to aim for almost every life. Now I go for UAV. Hunter Killer and Care Package, knowing that I can get all of three of those, usually even twice, in one go. Now that's just because my skill set, you might even be able to get higher than that or lower. What I also recommend is going like UAV, Counter UAV, and just get all the lowest ones you could possibly get. Just find the game type that you actually do get the most points in and just go to it. I recommend Hardpoint and Kill Confirmed the most out of all the ones. I don't know if anything could beat them. Me personally, I'm Kill Confirmed, but you might even be all the way to the point of Search and Destroy. It just depends on your skill set. Just be kind of easy on yourself and don't try to be uh, hardcore about it and just go Search and Destroy and get like 20 kills on so it. So once you start up a new game, I'm going to be doing Kill Confirmed, but I just make sure I go for the tags, do the objectives. I use Black Hat PDA, so I go ahead and hack a lot of objects and, you know, score streaks and all this good stuff. I make sure I throw down all my score streaks right as soon as I get them. I also make sure I grab every tag I get because tags give you a lot more points and kills on this game. And I just make sure I just be doing the objective, and actually I tend to do better this way anyways. Okay, so once you get finished doing a game or a semi-good game, you just want to go ahead and just finish it up and just do it over and over and over again until you hit 55. Then you can go ahead and prestige, or you can stay at 55 like me because I don't like prestiging. But that's pretty much it. Thank you guys for watching. This is my cool. Hopefully, I guys taught you guys a few tips or tricks. Anyways, I'm going to talk to you guys later. See ya. Good job, SEALs. Stand by for further orders.